Hello, beautiful. You guys never fail to amaze me with all the messed up shit you do to your hair and I am ready to see it all today. I hope I see some unique content, some new approaches to ruining our hair, and I hope I end this video needing some psychiatry. That's when you know we saw something really fucked up. So as much as I don't want to keep paying my psychiatrist to do her job, I mean, I, I'm here for you. I'm here to entertain you. Move dog, daddy's got work to do. <laughs> Should I start using my masculine voice when I do videos? Like, I'm just like, yo, we're gonna watch some videos today, bro. We're gonna see what these people are doing to their hair. Hopefully it's good. <laughs> yeah, bro. I won't do that. I won't scare you too much today. I have a list today that my lovely person who works on these videos with me did for me. This one is called Butterfly Haircut Gone Wrong. And yes, she is following my tutorial. So let's see. <laughs> I'm sure I did it correctly here. You did it correctly, but oh my God, you cut off so much. I mean, like that's a good amount if you had long hair, but your hair was already short and you cut off a whole lot more hair than I was expecting. That's for sure. That is going to literally be like everywhere. Mm. Moment of truth. <gasps> Listen, I was expecting a bad result after she cut that first piece, but this is wild. <laughs> oh, she got some bounce back going on there. Just like brrr, that bang section is just like beep, 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 beep. <gasps> I'm not blaming it on me. She fucked up. It's all you, babe. It's all you. Okay, with a little bit of styling, we can make this look good. Just flatten those bangs down. Put some heat on there, push it down. Make it as flat as possible so it at least touches your eyebrows. Come on, please. Here's the before. Yeah, don't do that again. And if you do it again, just don't cut so much off the front of your hair. What do we think was gonna happen when we cut it this close to our head? You know what I mean? Like, come on, don't think before we do a little chop. Let's watch somebody flat iron their wet hair. Get ready with me to go on a date. No matter how many times I see somebody flat iron their wet hair, it automatically triggers me. That, that unique sound, those hot burning plates hits that sopping wet hair. It goes into my body and then into my face and then you see what I, what I look like and it pains me a little bit. That hair inside that iron is just like, don't do it. Please stop. And then you just run over it again and again and again. Something about flat ironing wet hair is this one says bleaching gone wrong. Thought dying just a chunk of my hair on my own would be okay. The start of a disaster. Melted off. Went in for a few more rounds of bleach like a dummy. Got black in the blonde. Ended up looking like Doc from Back to the Future. All to go back to black and have a mohawk. There's so much to unpack there. What just happened? Let me see it again. Thought dying just a chunk of my hair on my own would be okay. The start of a disaster. Melted off. Went in for a few more rounds of bleach. Okay, whoa, hold on. You lost me when you said a few more rounds of bleach. A few more in addition to the first one on your black box side hair? Ha! <sighs> That's literally crazy. And then she got the black box dye on her hair somehow? Like, how does that even happen? What the fuck? <laughs> the part that really messed me up though is the last part when she showed just a little strand of hair that she was left with. It was a little mohawk as she called it. Um, what the fuck? 
Y'all keep doing that. That is called breakage. Put down the bleach, don't ever touch it again. This one is titled Color Fail. Time has come for a new color to enter this area because what the hell? This is bleach, by the way. It is not the color. I got this pale purple, but because I think if I put pale purple on this nasty yellow green, something very bad would happen. So I'm just gonna bleach it first and then wait a couple days. I'm gonna include it on this video. So don't get scared, okay? It'll, all the clips will be in here, all right? I'll be right back. I'm not scared of you not including the clips. I'm scared of what you're about to do to your head. This days later, I just woke up. So like, excuse my hair, but I figured I'd show you the bleachy bits, but it actually worked way Way better than I thought it would. Bleach that I used was called like the Color Oops Bleaching Conditioning Kit, whatever. It was the only bleach that they had at Walgreens. It was so strong. I thought I'd accidentally mixed it wrong and created toxic gas. I swear to God, bleach, it's gonna literally be the death of me. I can feel bleach going into my lungs and I always use bleach because I love bleach in a lot of different ways, but I can literally feel the bleach going into my lungs and slowly killing me inside. Sometimes I'm like, I can't do this anymore because I'm gonna die from this. Some of them get really Really, really bad like if you're in a small space and you don't have windows open it gets really strong so I'm just gonna stick some big greasy Vaseline on my head to stop my face from getting purple then I'm gonna hit this with the purple oh my god my phone's dying again this is the color wait we don't want that in our eyes oh hang on get away from me okay so she is putting what looks like lavender over her yellow hair and her hair is quite yellow so I'm expecting that this is gonna turn gray or just kind of neutralize and be blonde I don't think it's gonna work were mistakes made? Maybe. A little. Have I accepted it? Absolutely. Will I be dyeing my hair again before the wedding? Yup. Are you gonna have to go to a part two? Yup. <laughs> it looks fine. Why is this on the disaster list? This looks great. What the fuck? Why did you put this on here? She looks great. She needs another coating of the lavender for sure, but for what it is, it looks decent. I'm into it. I do think it's a cute look. Like if it was done very nicely and um, we completed the look. I feel like just another layer. Let's get the yellow out of there. Let's pull it all together. It'll look fierce. This one's called Blonde Gone Wrong. Okay, I'm dyeing my hair blonde from this brunette. I'm using the nine levels of lift. Honestly, I think I'm just gonna do a balayage. It's the safest. <laughs> We're starting off with like already colored hair. We're going to the box dye. I don't know if this is bleach or color. It looks to be color. I'm not really sure. I don't know. I just looked at the box again in the video. It, it might be bleach. I'm not sure. Either way, she's fine. Because her hair is already dry, it's already processed. She's gonna try and do balayage on her own head, which never really works out at home because balayage is a really tough skill to master, even for a professional. The hairdresser that did my hair brown, best hairdresser I have ever been to. He's absolutely amazing the best brown that i've ever had it had no tint of red or anything in it anyway if you're wanting to get your hair done please go to Kane. it's in the shire well where is the hairdresser where is he when you need him i hopefully won't botch this but honestly i never let anyone do my blonde she only lets people do her brunette color not the blonde makes Zero sense. <laughs> okay, I actually love this color. Hey, damn minute. I thought you were doing balayage. What was that application? Why were we just brushing it through like that? What? Okay, we keep it. But I'm gonna have to develop again tomorrow. It's not blonde enough. It's not like the same as I had it before. My hair is frying off full. Anyway, I actually will have to do a part two. Okay, this is the hair color. I just went and bought this, eight levels of lift. To part two. I left that underneath brown because I kind of like that. <laughs> Girl, we're going in again? The hair can't take anymore. Don't do it again. Why are we doing it again? Please don't do it again. She did, hasn't posted part two yet. I'm scared. That was enough for, for that. Call it quits. Throw a little toner on there. Just spruce it up a little bit. Let's stop. Most of the time, just people need to put down the bleach. <laughs> that was so scary. This one is titled Cutting Eyelashes. What do you mean? Um, I'm gonna tell you something. Got me. Um, that is not how that works. It's actually completely a myth that if you cut something, it'll grow faster. And say if you shave off your eyebrows, they're not gonna grow differently the second time. That is completely a myth. And if I'm wrong, just correct me below. I know y'all will, so we don't even have to say that. What I learned in cosmetology school, which is all about hair and how it grows and the body and all that shit, it's it, no matter if you shave it off, you do anything to it, it's not gonna grow back thicker and fuller and darker. Every bald man in the world would be shaving their head and would have the thickest hair if that was true. Think about that one. This one's called bleach pull test. <laughs> I already know where this one is going. <laughs> If you feel like 
you need to pull the hair to know if the hair is breaking or not. You're probably gonna experience some breakage. Girl. <laughs> that was brutal. Oh my god. It's not even like it got stringy or like elastic-y. It literally just fully snapped off and like this much hair just fully snapped off the head. Damn, girl. That sucks. I hope you're okay. Hope you're still alive. Hope everything's good. Hope the hair grew back. Don't do that again. This one's called Box Dye Fail. Already, don't put that on that head. Don't do that. It looks like she already had colored hair. Color doesn't lift color. You gotta bleach it. <laughs> and to think that she's gonna lift her hair from that dark color she has to that box dye color, which is like super blonde, maybe level nine or 10. I forget what it looks like at this point, but uh, no, that's not gonna happen. No, 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 no. Girl, it's orange. It is orange. And uh, that's gonna be very hard to get out. Oh boy, is it. Oh b -b 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 boy, that's a disaster. Don't do that. A lot of don't do that today. Hello? Oh, it's my therapist, yeah. Oh, I just finished filming. Yeah, I'm ready for my session. Okay, great. Horrifying. Is the word I would use to describe that, all of that. And I loved it. <laughs> If you guys want to check out my hair care or my hair color line, you can do so with the links right down below or go to xmonohair.com. That is all for today. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to live your extra life and I'll see you next time. Bye.